when I talk about like how I grew up listening to country music and I realize like that that's kind of how I learned how to write songs was by growing up listening to those songs and the way that you set up a hook and the way that you start from a title and you tell a story you just kind of let it all happen and come together and that song is the quintessential just like this is how you write a country song Um, cheers to a great song and a great friendship, and hopefully uh, many other great songs and uh, great times to come. All right, cheers I love you guys. You. Yeah, love, love you, you too. Combo. Double D. Yep. Connie Gray. Cheers, girl. And so I remember like starting a group text or something and being like, "We should write," and then Brett goes, "Well, you know, when Connie and I get together, it's involving with tequila and cigars." When tequila we write. and cigars. Yeah, it's it, the tradition. Yeah. Yeah. So yeah. I walked in at 10:30 to like a shot of tequila that <laughs> Connie poured me. You actually had the like the gun bottle. Do you remember what that was? He brought it back from vacation. Oh, that's what it was. That that's what it was, yeah. Crystal tequila. I would have known yeah. that I brought that today. So Good. We finished Good. that bottle that Good. day. Country, well, I walked in, I was like, country country yeah, and Connie's like, you want to write a country song today? All right, let's write a country song. <laughs> What's great about Devin is when you say a line, or whoever it is that says it, and he really connects with it. He's so passionate and it's just like your eyes light up yeah. <laughs> and it's it's so great it's the greatest it's like, yes thing. that's it that's it that's yes, the line yes I love yeah. that you do that and that you're passionate and it helps the other writers in the room know where you're at and yeah. I love it about you it you always write this way I've written several songs with you but you know like here's Devin yeah just okay all right, yeah. it's the guy, he's in the bar, he's, all right. I'm pacing, I had like black right. coffee so, and tequila. And this is the way he feels right yeah. here, you know, and he sees her over there and I'm like, you know, it's like the energy the over is here, like He's like circling, asking for a friend like 40 times on his favor. He's yeah. like, okay, yeah. I gotta just get in the mode here. You move, you move yeah. with the song, through the song. He's and it's, it's a lot of energy, yeah. He's you stalk it like a, you know, tiger. I like it, it's good. I, it. I remember we had so many hooks. We had so many like setups to asking for a friend. And the, the, the way that we wrangled this song was trying to figure out which where each one went, right? Like, you don't know at the end if he's really asking for yeah. a friend or if he's asking or for her. himself. Like you, I feel like all the guys are like, yeah, 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 she took him back, you know? And all the girls are like, nah, she didn't take him back. Like, he messed up, you know? And so everyone has their own kind of take on it. And, and about, about five days or maybe a week after we wrote it, you texted me and said, this song fucking breaks my heart. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, that I actually, that, okay, I don't know if I've told you this, but I went home that night, and usually you'll let a work tape kind of sit a little bit and get fresh ears on it, listen to it the next day. And I was drunk, because we had drank in two bottles of tequila, right. and I got home and I was like, I don't care, I'm gonna listen to it, you know? And after the first chorus, I just started crying. Like, I just started weeping, and that I was night. like, it was like, it's so good, that like, night, it's yeah. so good, yeah. That's the whole point of this, right, is we hold off and we don't talk about it until we sit down, and like, that's when the magic happens, when you just start talking through it, like, that's the point of this whole thing, is to bring people into this room, to get them to feel what we felt when we wrote it, to, to get people to understand the culture of Nashville and songwriting, and get all of our personalities and everything that we do on a daily basis that to us is normal, right? And to them, like, they I don't just, know. Yeah, they don't. I want to let people in on what we do every single day, and that's mm -hmm. the point of this, and that's why that's why I love this I mean, concept. Yeah, I love you guys, Thank man. You, dude. Cheers. Love you too, man. Oh, dude, Connor, girl. Girl. Just wondering if anyone was sitting here And if not, would it be okay If someone bought you a beer Let's say that someone wanted to dance Would he have a snowballing hell of a chance To get you out on the floor Before this slow song ends Oh, hey, 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 I'm just asking for a friend He ain't never been any good at laying it all out on the line no. But I swear down deep, believe me, girl, he's a really good guy 
can find it in your heart just to cut him some slack He'll be Johnny on the spot in two seconds flat Yeah, he's holding his breath, come on, give him a second wind Oh, hey, yeah, yeah, yeah One drink would show me a lot to him Hey, I'm just asking for a friend Let's say this friend of mine went messed up real bad And he'd do anything in this world, girl, to get you back Hey, what kind of sorry would it take For a man to erase his worst mistake And would this even begin to make a dent Oh, hey Asking for a friend mm -hmm. Yeah, what if I told you He hadn't slept in weeks And he was standing right here In front of you Instead of me Was there any way You could ever love him again I'm just asking for a friend